earlier this year, we um, went out and polled um, business leaders around the, around the globe uh, in 20 countries. And we asked them, how do they see the future of innovation and what, is the, what are the keys to success? And no matter where these executives sit in the world, they all came back with three key things, which I think answers, I, I think business executives are, know they need design thinking and problem solving. They all said they, they recognize the role of the creative individual and they realize that they don't, they don't embrace that in their organization and they need to. So they know they need more creative people in their companies. They know that they have to collaborate <clears throat> in the future. That they can't, no one, the, our, our problems are too big, they're too complicated. The environment, healthcare, transportation, whatever it is in your industry, you can't do it alone. Big companies need to embrace startups, academics, governments, more kind of partnerships and collaboration. And then third, this idea that profit on its own isn't sustainable, it has to have a purpose. So when you hear that, and, and it was Saudi Arabia to Japan, interestingly, Saudi Arabia had the most optimism for what innovation is going to do. I just came back from there last uh, two weekends ago and did a discussion with some of our customers in the Middle East. and. It's so exciting. I mean, they're redesigning things. They're, they're bringing in designers to help them in hospitals and airlines. And so I do think that business, especially in some of these emerging markets, Brazil, India, <coughs> Middle East, you're starting to see design come into the mix in a way that I find quite delightful.